Welcome back, and today we're checking out another one from XG. I was going to do this earlier. I think it was a performance video for Left Right, but I'm glad I waited because they've released an official music video. I didn't even know they were going to do that, but it worked out in my favor because today is the day I had available to film, and I believe today, or yesterday technically, is the day it was released. With that said, after Shooting Star, which has become my most played song, I believe it may, may be my most played song this year already. I have high hopes for this, which could be good or bad, depending on how much I enjoy this. With that said, let's just jump into it. Interesting choreo. I got what you want, I got what you need. Mobbin like we don't follow anything. Oh, left, right, get it on the floor. I wanna see you left, right, get in my zone. Then we hit the slide, ready for the swing. We don't want no ops, want no drama queen. Left, right, everywhere. I like that outfit with the green hair. Okay, I know there's a lot of talk about Y2K and kind of late 90s music and concepts in K-pop today, which they're not K-pop Japanese, but a global group. I mainly focus on K-pop here. So in the music industry, I guess I should say, there's a lot of talk about that. So far, I noticed it with Shooting Star and I'm noticing it even more with this, which this is reminding me of some 90s as well. Kind of TLC in a way. In the 90s into the 2000s. XG's, this, this is what I remember from that time. The other ones seem like a more modern version. This seems like what I remember from the Y2K. And the music, the styling. This is smooth. As I said, remind, it, for some reason I just keep getting put in the mind of like Aaliyah or TLC. Something along those lines. And they're pulling it off flawlessly. I 
I'm glad I waited for a music video, but also I kind of want to see that performance video. I need to check that out. Is that choreo makes me want to see, of course you get to see it more. I believe it was a performance video that it was. I could be wrong, but I want to see more of the choreo. But that chorus is so smooth and so perfect. That's the main part that I said reminded me of something like TLC or Aaliyah. Something along those lines from that time period. And uh, I was thinking this through it, trying to determine if, if it is true. I think I may like this one better than Shooting Star, which I didn't think was possible. I thought Shooting Star was going to be my absolute favorite from XG. I wasn't sure they were ever going to top it. Not only did they top it, they topped it in the same album. They, I think I mentioned it last time, they're quickly becoming one of my favorite groups. And if they keep this up, they will be my favorite group. All I want now, I want more music because, well, this one's going to be on repeat, just as Shooting Star was. But I want more from them now. And they can pull off both styles. They can pull off the rap. They can pull off this more R&B, laid back, smooth vibe. And they do both of them so well. Honestly, don't know why they haven't blown up. Maybe it's just because promotion. I don't know why they're not more popular in the United States. Because I feel like they could be. They could take over here, in, in my opinion. Yeah, they really need to promote in a lot of different areas. Not just the United States. Which, that's, that's the only one I'm talking about because I live here, so I know more about it. Yeah, I feel like they could do extremely well here. And I hope they do get to that point. Because they deserve it. Because putting out music like this, Shooting Star, and Left, Right, Back to Back, yeah, it just shows their talent and versatility. I went into this one, as I said, not expecting to like it near as good as Shooting Star. And I came out even before I got to the halfway point. As soon as that chorus came in, I... Uh, let me just go back to that. As soon as that chorus came in, I kind of felt that I was going to enjoy it more. I was going to end up liking it more than Shooting Star. And after it's over, I believe that is the case. I don't know. It's a toss-up. I, I enjoy both of them. And I hope they release more this year and soon. Because we need more of this. We need an entire album by this point. I just want more of their music. And I want to see more of their choreo. They have some of my favorite choreos. They also have some of my favorite music videos, especially going back to this, as I said, Y2K style. Definitely my favorite in terms of doing it. I say Y2K, but I was getting a lot of 90s, like late 90s, 98, 99, which could be considered Y2K depending on who you ask, because in the US we were in that transitional period where everybody thought as soon as 2000 hit, then we were going to be living in space for whatever reason. I never understood why we thought that, but a lot of people apparently seem to have thought that. So it fits perfectly in nostalgia, it just takes me right back to it. One on my playlist, uh, I feel like I shouldn't even have to say that at this point. They've surprised me twice this year already, and I can't wait to see what they bring out next. All I know is I hope it's soon. Let me know what you thought of this. Let me know which one you like better out of. Shooting star, left, right. I think the reason I said it's reminding me of Aaliyah is because it, that left, right chorus reminds me of Rock the Boat by Aaliyah. And I think that's why it's reminding me of her. But yeah, let me know what you thought about it. Let me know which one's your favorite out of the two. I'm gonna, as soon as I end this video, I'm listening to it again. I will see you in the next video.